Or Claire Hockey. Thank you, Presiding Officer. To ask the Scottish Government how it plans to support community groups to ensure that they leave a cultural legacy from the Year of Young People activities. Minister. A great deal of activity is currently underway to make this year a, a catalyst for new ways of working uh, with uh, young people at a local level. Uh, through our Create 18 fund, the government is supporting young people to work with community groups throughout Scotland to plan and deliver high quality community events, helping young people to showcase their talents and contributions to their local communities and helping to change attitudes and perceptions of young people. We're also working with local authorities to give young people the opportunity to have their voices heard and to create a lasting cultural change by putting uh, young people at the heart of local decision making and the co-design of the services which they use. Claire Hockey. I thank the Minister for his answer. Uh, groups like Universal Connections in Rutherglen and Cambus Lang and Terminal 1 in Blantyre have events planned throughout the year to mark the Year of Young People, from the Forever Young event in Cambus Lang to the musical showcase featuring children from across my constituency of Rutherglen. It's good to see local groups fully on board with this great initiative. Can the Minister advise on whether a legacy evaluation will be undertaken to measure the success of this year's Year of Young People in order to learn from the positive lessons for the next themed year in 2020. Minister. Yes, we are developing an evaluation framework for the Year of Young People, which will ensure that the aims and objectives and the outcomes of that year are met, and uh, that will measure the success of co-designing Scottish Government policies too, uh, in order to create a lasting legacy beyond 2018. Now, all of that complements the uh, evaluation which Young Scot themselves are leading, uh, and uh, they are doing so uh, looking at the overall co-design element of the year. So the Scottish Government is certainly committed to ensuring that the programme of themed years engages with young people and will continue to invite representatives from uh, children and young people's organisations to join with us directly uh, to make sure that their interests are fully represented.